When a file is opened in the data processing module of TOF-DS, we see exactly the same view as with the real-time data processing. The same icon-based layout is used, with all the tools organized under headers, making it easy to find what you're looking for. There are no drop-down menus with hidden parameters, making it faster and simpler to use. To open additional files, there is a handy results browser. Clicking on a file gives you a useful preview, plus all of the header information containing the analysis parameters. Double-clicking on the file opens it in the data processing window. A new icon is shown to represent that file and can easily be removed by right-clicking. The chromatographic view can be adapted to suit the preference of the individual users, whether it's overlay mode, stacked mode, or swivel mode. In this case, we're looking at two files that have been run using Select EV Variable Energy Ionization for Benchtoff. The upper file was run at 70 EV, and the lower represents soft ionization at 14 EV. Inverting these charts allows users to explore the data easily and see the differences between the 70 EV and simplified 14 EV spectra. In complex samples, like this one, the toggle view is very useful because it shows you the region that you've zoomed in on and you can simply drag that box to navigate the full chromatogram. Another useful tool is the saved extracted ion sets. Opening up a new EIC allows us to see the stored values for a particular compounds or chemical class. This eliminates the need to type in the EIC values every single time. For example, searching for benzyl benzoate immediately brings up the stored values, which we can then apply to find the peak that we're interested in. Here we see that the correct peak has been found by simply checking it against the NIST 14 library. To save users even more time, the top library hit appears in the scroll bar when a peak is selected, meaning that you don't need to manually library search each individual peak. If we find a peak of interest, it can be easily added to a target compound library by filling in the relevant details. Any processes applied to the open file can be saved to a method. This means that we can open up a subsequent file using that method to apply all the same integration parameters and library searches immediately, rather than having to go through the full process again. Clicking Open allows us to choose any data processing method and apply it to a file straight away. This saves time because you don't have to build a new batch processing sequence for just one or two files. You can apply a method directly from this browser.